Hey everybody, well here we are today, told you we was going to get her apart, me and the old man spent the day getting her apart, it's not good, got her out, got her all sorted away, cylinder didn't look bad, crank didn't look bad, and we started looking, I'll show you what we discovered. Got a crack right here, busted on up into it. So we thought, okay, flywheel, no big deal, right? Okay, wrong. So we got out here, there was a bunch of crud. Looked like they had stuff in the heads, probably what caused the initial problem. Probably overheated, everything's showing overheated. Then we got to looking, and if you look, you right there. I think you can see how she just follows her right on around there. That pretty much makes the program over. But, we got a crank. It didn't look too bad. I even think the one that the rod come apart on would clean up. But, I don't know, I just thought maybe you might want to know if anybody was wondering. But that's the news, it ain't good, so we're going to be in the market for a 532 block, I guess. We're going to try to stay with it. But that's that. What do you got to say about it, Dad? <laughs> Not a whole lot. Not a whole hell of a lot, huh? Piece of good material there. But anyway... Yeah, it was kind of the letdown of the day, man. That's the way it goes. Can't win them all, I guess. But on a positive note, everything seems pretty good. Pump, you know, I mean, she's not all the wore out. You know, front end's in good shape. PTO pulley, everything looks good. Worst thing happened, we'd have to do a repower, maybe. But, uh, anyways, that's about the extent of that. Okay, well, I guess I'll just make this one a short one today, guys. Uh, man, our parts piles are adding up. Anyways, that's it. We'll see you on the next one, I reckon. You guys have a good one, man. Hope you have better luck than we did this round on anything you try. Later.